have to ask you about Cam Newton because he had a recent press conference where he had this to say. He said, I am an African-American quarterback that may scare a lot of people because they haven't seen nothing they can compare me to. Now, you have played with African-American quarterbacks. Are they under a different scrutiny than Caucasian quarterbacks? You know, it's, it's tough for me to say, uh, being, being Caucasian. I don't think so. I mean, I think, I think I'd like to think that we're – that were at least maybe not completely past, but further along than we were. I mean, I, I think it back to Doug Williams when mm -hmm. he when he led the Redskins to a title. I mean, Dante Culpepper, uh, Michael Vick was another guy who kind of took the league by storm. So I don't, you know, seeing an African American quarterback play at a high level uh, is nothing new. But Cam's game is new. I mean, th this type of athlete we've we've never seen before. And and I I think you know, in my opinion, and and right, you you just know well, you. Know, your environment and what you read. Most, I mean, how can you not love Cam Newton? 99% of the stuff I read is extremely positive. The way he's playing, his, his smile, his personality, giving the balls to the kids in the stands. I mean, he, he's the undisputed leader of that team and his, his enthusiasm and, and his passion is, is, is evident and his fingerprints are, are all over that team and kind of this, this team and, and, and win attitude that they have. How important is Cam Newton? Now you're working on the league side. To have someone like him, um, is this to, you know, take the torch from the Peytons and the Tom Brady's who are going to be retiring soon? You know, well, absolutely. From, from a league standpoint, you know, I mean, stars drive the league and the quarterback position, that, that is the position. So, so you love to see that as someone that works for the NFL, but just as a fan of the game. Mm -hmm. I mean, I, I, have, I, have, I have lots of kids, but my, my boys, my seven-year-old, his favorite player two years ago, he's Cam Newton. Cam Newton was his guy. And, you know, I see Cam out there and how hard he plays. And again, all the things that, that I mentioned before, and and just as a father, you're you're grateful that there's that there's role models like that in your league for for your kids to look up to. Yeah, it's funny because the criticism of Cam is the exact opposite that he's too showboaty, that he's not a good role model. Is this a generational thing? It might be a generational thing. You know, I think some people certainly. Uh, I, I think there's a fine line between showboating and maybe trying to show your opponent up, and just and just expressing and, and displaying your pure joy for the game. And to me. Certainly, I'm not a fan of, of showboating or taunting, but when I watch Cam Newton, I see someone that just enjoys the game and is kind of and is in the moment and enjoys his teammates, and that's what that's what football's all about. Yeah.